Hi everybody, this is Ian Lamont from In 30 Minutes Guides. Today I'm going to show you two ways to change the font size in Firefox for Windows or Mac OS. If this video helps, please take a moment to like it and follow me and let's get started. Here I am in Firefox. You can see my Gmail spam folder. This is the font size. Let's say that I want to make it bigger. Two ways to do it. In Firefox, go to the upper right corner. You'll see a menu, a menu icon. It looks like three lines. It's called the hamburger menu. Click on that, select settings. Two ways to find this particular setting. Just scroll down on the general area and you'll see it right here under fonts. The other way to do it is just to search for fonts, which is probably the easier way to do it. Okay, now you'll see that the default font is times size 16. This is what it looks like. This is size 16. We're gonna change that to size 30. Okay, now let's see what the spam folder looks like. And you can see it got a lot bigger, my spam, uh, my sp the, the text in this particular uh, web page. One thing to note, or actually two things to note. The first thing is, is that because it's so big, it's actually starting to cut off the letters. So just be aware of that. The second thing to note is that it doesn't work for all websites. This is the official usagov.website website. Uh, website and Actually, I changed the font size in Firefox. It still looks the same as it did before. And if I reload the page, you'll see it looks exactly the same. The reason for this is most websites nowadays, they actually set their own default web size, web, uh, font size, which means that no matter what you do in Firefox to change it to 30 or 40 or 10 or whatever, it will always look the same. However, there is a way around it. It's a little bit, it's not quite changing the font size, it's just zooming in. The, the effect is the same, it's easier to read. So in Firefox, go to the very top, there's like a menu bar, select view, zoom, and then zoom in. You can see everything just got bigger. I can do it again, zoom in, it got bigger again. So this is a workaround for the font size issue. You can also use keyboard shortcuts in Windows, it's control and then the plus button. In uh, Mac OS, it is command in the plus button. And then if you use command in the, in the minus button or control in the minus button, that will make it smaller, like I'm doing right now. For more information on how to get the most out of technology, go to in30minutes.com. We have a whole series of guides that relate to technology and other mildly complex topics from genealogy to crowdfunding. My name is Ian Lamont. I'm the founder of In 30 Minutes Guides. Thank you so much for watching.